For this hit to work, Alex must be able to identify a person who keeps their wallet in their back pocket. Alex has spotted someone patting his back pocket and moves in. Now it's Alex's job to make sure Paul knows who the target is and where the wallet is. And this is done with the age-old trick of using a bit of chalk. This man has now become the mark. This technique of using chalk to mark a target is where the term originated from. Alex has done his job, now it's Paul's turn. He spotted the mark and he knows that the wallet will be in his right pocket as Alex has placed the chalk deliberately on his right shoulder. Paul has to size up the shape of the wallet. The aim is to replace the Mark's wallet with a piece of folded newspaper of the same size without him noticing. One bump is all it takes. If you missed it like the Mark did, here it is again. No sooner has the wallet been taken from the Mark's pocket, Paul deposits it in Alex's umbrella, and they both make a quick getaway. The Mark now has a worthless piece of paper in his back pocket, but it still feels like he's got his wallet. And it's only when he tries to buy something that he finds out that he's been robbed. Somebody pushed me. And then I, I thought I wanted some water, so I went to the shop to buy a bottle of water. And uh, suddenly, when I went to pay for, for it, I hadn't, I hadn't got my wallet with me. I had just this piece of paper. 